All right, YouTube, I'm gonna show y'all how to take this cover off and put it onto the black one. I already put it onto the black one. Uh, what I did was, when this was on, right, I pressed it out and it got it almost all the way out, but then one of the ends broke right here. This end broken, I apologize for this, there you go. One of the ends broke right here. So with the clear one, I'm trying to be more careful. I've been, uh, they have these little slots in here, like these little holes, and I've been pushing these out, and it'll uh, pop, it'll help pop this whole cover off. But I'm gonna last one, I gotta be really careful because I do not want to break it, but it's like they're glued on there, so I'm trying to hold the case. At the same time as I push it out, it's gonna it's really nerve wracking, I'm especially if I do this twice. That these screws aren't really screws, they're just there. So I'm trying to let's see if we can pry this in here. I got one more corner left. So I'm prying it up from right here. So I'm gonna hold it up now with my finger on the uh the rim of this up. On the rim of this up, I'm gonna try to pry under here because just this corner. I'm try to push it out from this part again. Gotta be careful with these because these are shears. There we go. Boom. Get the scissors to pop it out. Now look. Bam. Definitely, you gotta be careful with this because if you know how much this clipper costs, you are not trying to. <laughs> you are not trying to crack that. You make sure you line these back up. There's like little slots that these uh, points go into. Wow. There it is. That's how the, the case should have came. So, that's that. I'm going to take the screws off from the clipper one. That's how you change the lid. Let's take off the lid. Boom. That's the case stuck. Oh, the lid's stuck. All right. Now you put it back on. Make sure you light everything up. And this is now how your machine should look. That looks way better. Staying all the way, so I'll rattle. There we go. So if you had a little bit of rattle, just press this uh, your little belly or whatever you want to call it. It's probably not all the way on, but boom, that's tough. I'm going to do the same thing with the trimmer. So I'll show you this trimmer real fast, and also I'm going to show you that I do have the gold blade on there. I don't have the black one because I put the gold blade on a different machine. And with this same uh, concept, loosen these, take the face plate off, punch this out very carefully, and that's how you do it. So, hey. and like I said, taking this out is very iffy because you can break one of these little uh, <laughs> things right here. See, I broke one off. So be really careful when you're doing this modification. It's a simple one, but you can easily mess up your face plate. Y'all yeah, know this machine ain't cheap. Press it in, right here, get that little snap. Hope it's in there good, because now it's going to rattle. We're going to find out. I don't know if y'all can see that. See how it's loose? And right, now that we have it on, screw this back. And I did have the, uh, I did in, end up hot gluing it. This will be transparent with y'all, but you can't tell anything like anything's wrong with it. Like I said, it's a mod, man. You gotta, <laughs> it didn't come like this. 
It did not come like this. Maybe they might, uh, when they if they get enough enough people mentioning that, which I don't think they will. But they get enough people mentioning that, maybe they might make all the face plates clear. But I think everybody's going for that all black look, and I feel like that's what uh, inspired them to do that lid in particular like that. Because people that want it all black out, some people don't like the clear, the see through, so you can see the motor. Yeah, I understand that. So you try to accommodate for everybody. Not everybody's gonna be pleased. Like some people might like it. I'm over here complaining. <laughs> you know, so it is what it is. And when I put the um, hot glue in there, I just put it on the edges, like right here, but on the actual lid. Not on this, not on this part that I'm attaching. On the lid part, on top. And yeah, so, so that's how you put it on. Now we got. Two Starcraft machines with the gold lids, golden black lid with the see through. And that's pretty dope. Haven't used them yet, can't wait to use them now. If y'all watching, Thank y'all for watching. Like, share, subscribe, all the good stuff. And uh, I'll see y'all in the next upload. Peace.